Ribbon Rosette Tutorial, delivered by Colourlu Carnival Arts, commissioned by Third Sector Leaders Kirklees Supporting Communities. What you'll need, two pieces of wide ribbon, a needle and thread, a piece of card, we used an old cereal box, paint, including white and or ink, a pencil and compass or any other small round object, a glue stick, scissors and a safety pin. To start, sew a loose running stitch along the length of your ribbon. Each stitch should be approximately 1cm. Once you reach the end, gather the ribbon gently until it's nicely ruffled. Fix your ruffle with a stitch at the end of the ribbon, then trim the end straight if needed. Repeat this process with your second piece of ribbon. Take one of your ruffles and pin the ends right sides together. Then sew a blanket stitch along the raw edge to seal the ends together. Take the second ruffle and wrap it around itself into a loose rose-like shape, stitching it into place as you wrap. Now stitch the two pieces together with the rose-like shape on top in the centre. Use a compass or round bottomed object to draw two equal sized cardboard circles. Cut out your circles and paint one of them with white paint. Acrylic gesso also works. Whilst the paint dries, attach the other circle to the rosette base using four tacking stitches around the edges. Once the white circle has dried completely, it's time to paint. We used yellow and green ink to go with the green ribbon. When the paint or ink layer has dried, apply glue to the back and stick it carefully onto your rosette base.
Continue decorating your badge with text, sequins, glitter glue and stickers or anything else you have. Your rosette can be worn by using a safety pin to attach it to your clothing or accessories. Ribbon Rosette Tutorial by Colourloo Carnival Arts Commissioned by Third Sector Leaders Kirklees Supporting Communities